And the governor just announced major changes in his plan to reopen the state. 10 News reporter Rachel Bianco has the guidelines that still need to be met. Standing inside an empty restaurant in Napa, the governor announced a major shift in California's road to reopening. Bottom line is people can go at their own pace uh, and we are empowering our local health directors and county officials. Under the previous guidelines, one of the requirements included no COVID-19 deaths for 14 days. Under the new criteria, a county can move deeper into phase two if it has stable hospitalizations of COVID patients on a seven day average of daily percent change of less than 5% or no more than 20 COVID hospitalizations on any single day in the past 14 days. In addition, the county must see less than 25 new cases per 100,000 residents in the past 14 days, or less than 8% testing positive in the past week. Testing is improving, tracing, uh, we are training and, is, and deploying our, our tracers. We're getting PPP. Uh, up or PPE up uh, and we're getting it out uh, and we are seeing a significant uh, steady rate of decline over a long period of time in the number of people hospitalized. The governor also says if trends continue in the right direction, hair salons and in-store retail may open in a few weeks. We're moving into important a uh, few weeks ahead of us and uh, we're going to start seeing a lot more activity. Uh, let's just make sure we do it thoughtfully uh, and very, very strategically. The governor estimates 53 of California's 58 counties meet the guidelines to loosen restrictions. It's unclear if San Diego is one of them. Rachel Bianco, 10 News.